Morning. How's it going? Doing good. How about yourself? Right. Yeah. Asking 75 for all three? Yeah, all three of them. That ice house in the back doesn't work. Okay. I just, you know, if you could get it fixed or, you know what I mean? I yeah. You would have something, and I don't know whether it would cost. Because they both work. You have any other Cincinnati red stuff, like bobbleheads or any kind of memorabilia? Uh, I got a couple of them Wheaties boxes over there from 90. Okay. They're not in the best shape. Oh, that's cool. Is that just like a big bottle? Yeah, huh. that's something. Uh, 2000 they come out with I've got a, the box that that goes in interesting also. I've never seen that yeah they uh yeah it's just one of them you know millennium things everybody was cashing in on Harley Davidson cigarettes yeah what in the world how old are these uh, they're old that's not something you see every day no you know, I don't know how long they made them, or yeah. I can't even remember where I bought them at now. I probably bought them out in Sturgis or something like that. How much are these? A uh, dollar. I'll buy those. All right, I owe you twenty-one dollars. Make it twenty. It's good. All right, I appreciate it. Thank you, sir. All right, thanks a lot. Good luck with the sale. Yeah. Got four of your VHS tapes here. Oh, Thank you. I almost didn't hey, wait a minute. Those. I got a whole bag of them. You want to see what I have? Yeah, sure. Is you want Gone one? with the Wind? No, that's okay. I usually get movies I watched when I was a kid. Appreciate you bringing them out, anyways. Beaches. Oh, we'll put them out. I just forgot about them. Yeah. Have a good day. Thank you. <laughs> Are you the greeters? Hi. Thank you Morning. For them. Oh, of course. <laughs> I'm doing good. How are you doing? Doing well, thanks. Would you take five for your skates? We'll probably stay firm on the t on the ten on those because they're Rydells and they're really they're really in good shape. Okay, I'll pay yeah. the ten. Oh. There you go. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Have a great day. You too. Jack FM is getting you back outside with a thousand bucks. Here's your winning word. Nick. N-E-C-K. Nick. 
There's your change. Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you, guys. Good luck go. with the sale. Okay, Appreciate you. the help. Have a great one. How much is your computer? He has a question on that. How much is that? What did we say? I thought we said 25. It's, I'm pretty sure it works. What'd you do, 20? Well, yeah. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Hey, thank you. What's up, guys? Today I was in Centerville, Ohio. They had a citywide sale. It's only about 30 minutes north of me, so I was just freestyling, driving around, hunting down signs for garage sales, and found quite a bit. I went to about a dozen sales or so, got some good stuff. I got it all pulled out, and I'm going to show you what I bought. I got some VHS tapes at one sale. I've been collecting a lot of, you know, some of my favorite movies on VHS. So we got Back to the Future 3, Ferris Bueller's Day Off, Batman, Back to the Future 2. I wish they hadn't written their name on there, but... They were a quarter a piece, so I went ahead and picked all those up. Got this Kenwood receiver for 10 bucks. It is really clean. Everything at that estate sale was really clean. Um, some of the prices were just a little too high for me, uh, but I was happy to buy this one for 10 bucks, and it is going around like $80, $90, or something like that. I got some Harley Davidson cigarettes at one sale. Um, the guy wasn't sure where he got them. He said maybe, you know, one of the Sturgis, like, bike rallies or whatever. I bought two packs of them for $5 each. And somebody actually sold a few of these on eBay for, like, $34. I doubt that, you know, we're really allowed to sell cigarettes on eBay, but these just were too cool to pass up. Also got this Doritos deck of playing cards. My mother-in-law collects playing cards, so I thought that'd be cool for her. Those were a dollar, but he just threw them in on the deal. And at that same sale, I got this Dale Earnhardt Bush NASCAR Mirror. This thing's still in the plastic, and it has all the uh, protective tape still on the frame. And I saw sold prices for this anywhere between like $80 and $100, so I was thrilled to get that for $10. Bucks. Got some ice skates at one sale. These are Rydell brand. It is R-I-E-D-E-L-L. -L. That's the logo right there. Anytime I find Rydell skates, if I can get them cheap enough, I'm going to pick them up. These are kids. They're like size 12. They're going anywhere from like $20 to $30 bucks on eBay. So... I was in, I tried to get them a little bit cheaper, but I went ahead and paid the $10 because I think there's still a little bit of money to be made, but keep an eye out for these. Very nice skates. You can tell when you pick them up, um, the boot is going to be really hard. Uh, it just kind of helps keep the shape a little bit as opposed to the cheap figure skates. When you pick them up, you can squeeze them pretty easily and there's just, you know, not a lot of give to the cheaper ones. I got some remotes at one sale. I got six of them for a dollar each and I don't love flipping remotes but if i can find some nicer ones for cheap enough i'll go ahead and grab them and these were pioneer and onkyo so i got five pioneer and one onkyo so these are going to be going to like higher end like receivers units things like that so a lot of people that still have these old receivers are going to be looking for the remotes and you know for a buck a piece kind of hard to go wrong these should sell between like 15 to 20 dollars each they're easy to list easy to ship um yeah, remotes are, you know, a decent thing to look out for, especially if you're kind of new to reselling. You don't want to invest a lot of money. Just don't look for, you know, the RCA and like the cheaper stuff. You're mostly trying to find stuff for stereo equipment. You know, the VCR and TV remotes typically don't bring a lot of money. Also grab this little Sony voice recorder for 50 cents. I was hoping this would be worth more. It's only selling for about 15 bucks, but uh, sometimes the voice recorders can do pretty well. Last thing I found today was this Lenovo laptop. They said it worked. Uh, definitely needs cleaned up. I paid 20 bucks for it, and I saw the same model selling right around like $80 to $100. So I think there's a little bit of money to be made on that one. That is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.